Jagaban TV was at St. Peter's Cathedral, Arimo, the venue of the opening ceremony of the first session of the Seventh Synod of Ibadan North Anglican Diocese under the leadership of the Holy Spirit and the Most Reverend Shegun Oku Badejo, the Diocesan Bishop and Archbishop of Ibadan Ecclesiastical Province, which team a reminder we are laborers together with God, which is taken from 1 Corinthians chapter 3, verse 5 to 15. Some deserving members of the diocese were also decorated, the likes of Lady Evangelist B. B. Akeridolu, Dr. J. K. Akutiade, amongst others. The sermon was delivered by the Right Reverend Stephen Akobe, the Lord Bishop of Kaba Diocese. The cross of Christ is the center of the gospel and is the center of unity for the church. So those who work hardest shall of course fare best. Those who are most faithful shall have the greatest reward. They work together with God in promoting the purposes of His glory and the salvation of precious souls. And he who knows their work, God Almighty will do what? We take care that they do not labor in vain. They are employed in God's husbandry, in God's field, in God's business, not their own business, but in God's field, in God's husbandry, in God's farm, if you want, and in God's building. So the Apostle Paul wanted to make this clear to the church in Corinth in chapter 10, in chapter 3 of our text. Our focus is on that synod thing, co-workers, workers, laborers, together we go. I want to divide this message into three parts. First is that co-workers, laborers are real workers who are dedicated, faithful, and responsive. Number two, co-workers, laborers, are tested workers. They must be tested. And thirdly, laborers, co-workers, must be people or workers who are rewarded at the end of their labor, at the end of their work, at the end of their assignment, at the end of their ministry. They shall be rewarded. And let me also say quickly, when we refer to laborers, co-workers, we're not saying only or talking only of the clergy. We're saying all of us who are children of God, all of us who are born again, in one way or the other, we have been called. For me, there are two forms of call in life. The call to salvation. The call to come to know Jesus as your Lord and personal Savior. Secondly, the call to ministry. At the end, every man's works are what? Shall be tested. So if the work survives, then we come to the last part, which is the reward. If your work survives, there will be a reward. And the reward is very funny. It is not collective reward. St. Peter's, Tatiria, Aremo, oh yeah, come and collect your position. You know, it is one by one. God did the same the prayer of the poor man. That is God. And when God rewards, can you watch you? Can you watch you where you are? You are chief doctor, this and that. Doesn't matter before God. Because God is not a respecter of all of persons. But the work which you have done, the equivalent of that job, He will give to you. Somebody has said that in heaven there will be surprises. One surprise is that you will say, hey, if you know, so I made it. Number one surprise. Number two, the person you least expect to be there will say, hey, he yeah. Then the person you say, oh, you're going back. You see, eh? Hey, we'll in an interview with the chairman local organizing committee, Mr. Fulusho Olomola of the church Austin this year's synod, he talked extensively on what to expect from this year's synod. You no, know, the synod is, a, is an avenue where the church representatives discuss issues about the church, the progress of the church, what are the problems and how do we solve it. And the chairman of the, of the synod is the bishop, the archbishop. And uh, we are expecting uh, very sound words from him to encourage us to go further in Christian life, like he has always been doing. And we are expecting dignitaries to come and grace the occasion like you have today. The whole prog uh, program, the main program will start attacking LA uh, tomorrow. And that is where we will have Bishop's charge. That is, he reads his annual address. 
I will see dignitaries coming from different parts of the country. Then after that, we, have, we go into meetings, you see, uh, synod meetings, and hold meetings and dis, uh, take decisions on how to run the affairs of the church and make progress, both physical and spiritual. And that one will end, we extend till Thursday. Thursday evening, we have the uh, Thanksgiving random. And everybody will go back to his uh, churches and implement the whatever decision that has been reached. This report is packaged by Tadatulu Lokwe for Jagaban TV.